Hey guys, welcome to my part 2 review with the Nexus 4 picture and video. So first, the video is the day shot um, in the daytime at 720p. As you can see, the uh, void balance or ISO, I'm not sure exactly which one of those are that. You can see it calibrating as you go from the ground to the sky. Um, frame rates are also very good. Here we're going to go to now the night video. Um, a little bit of noise, I guess. Um, lighting is not so good in the area, so it's a little tough to say. But it does pick up natural lighting pretty well. Um, the colorations are basically what you would see in real life. So there's nothing um, extra saturated there. That's a good depending on what you prefer. And now we're going to go into photos. Um, so here we have the day shot. It's in auto settings. Haven't changed anything. It's a great shot. Very little noise whatsoever. Um, here we have a distance shot from up, get up top. And I'm going to crop it now to show you the zoom in effect and how well it handles the picture. As you can see, very little noise again in the daytime. Now we're at dusk. It's a different time of day to give, get you a different idea of different lighting scenarios. And now by switching the focus points, you can see how the lighting is changed. It's the exact same time. They're literally seconds apart, but I just changed the focus. That's, that's about it. So here we have the night shot in the night setting, obviously, to try and get the best shot possible did a decent job there now we have the um, indoors with the very low lighting without any flash in night setting and then I switch it to auto setting with the flash um, so you can get an idea it's a little greenish blue if you notice the flash setting there um, here we have the auto setting night shot and I'm gonna switch it up to the night setting so you can see that there's little more noise but a better shot I guess for you to see and we're gonna end it with a macro shot which is basically an autofocus it does it by itself you just point and shoot basically focus into what you want and yeah that's it guys um, if there are any other questions you have let me know post it in the comments below I'll try my best to answer them hopefully I cover different varieties of shots and videos and whatnot to get you at least a rough idea if not the full um, detail of how good this camera is uh, I would rate this camera probably about 7 out of 10 um, not the best um, but it's not bad either it is pretty good and considering the price of the phone itself is very affordable and the 8 megapixel is not shoddy, I guess. The people think that they slacked off on the camera. It, it is not the best, I agree. Um, but it's not the worst either. It is pretty good. Um, nighttime, it takes a natural lighting, which is really good. Uh, no color saturation and all that stuff. It's what you see is what you get kind of thing. Um, what you see in real life is what you get on the video. So um, I guess other than that, that's pretty much it. So subscribe and like the video as usual. And stay tuned for my next video, hopefully sometime soon. Alright, peace out guys.